Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about the evaluation of algebraic expressions through substitution. Now, when it comes to substitution through algebraic expressions, it's actually a pretty friendly process as long as you plug in the numbers correctly and being able to work through the operations correctly. So let's do a, an example, and you'll see how this works. Suppose you want to evaluate 4AB minus, let's just say, C squared, and you're given that A is equal to 3, B is equal to negative 4, and C is equal to, let's just say, negative 1. Now, what you're doing here is for every A, you're going to plug in 3, for every B, plug in negative 4, and for every C, plug in negative 1. So you have 4 times A is 3, B is negative 4, minus, and then parentheses, negative 1 quantity squared. So what you want to do is do the operation. So 4 times 3, that's going to give you 12. 12 times negative 4 is going to be negative 48. It's a little bit tricky over here, but just understand that the, the exponents happen before subtraction. So negative 1 squared is going to be positive 1. So at this point, you have negative 48 minus 1, which is going to give you negative 49. So the bottom line here is, when it comes to using substitution, as long as you plug in the numbers correctly in place of the variables, you should be good to go. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's how to evaluate algebraic expressions through substitution.